Hello guys, I apologize for that. I got cut off on that last video, so I'm going to try to pick up where I left off. I was talking about surrendering and obeying by faith. And when we do this, if we're talking about putting things down, when we're led to put them down, what we're doing is we're showing God that we are willing vessels, that that there's nothing that we are holding on to above him. That's showing him that we're willing to do it his way versus our way. And that's surrender. And why faith comes in and why faith is so important in this is because we have to believe that his way is right. We have to believe that his way is good. Because if we don't believe that, if we lack the faith, and therefore we lack the surrender, then we won't obey. Because we think that we can do it our way by satisfying what we want. And sometimes when we do that, we are robbing ourselves, really, of what we need. Because what we want is in the way of what we need. And what we need will always benefit us to the fullest versus what we want. We are always pursuing what we want, you know what I mean? We, we pursue what we want, and if we're only pursuing what we want and neglecting what we need, we will always find ourselves needing. And interestingly enough, we'll still find ourselves wanting. We will keep pursuing the things that we want, but we won't be fulfilled, and we'll still have that need. And the thing that we need is him. And it we get that when we submit by faith, by obedience, when we believe. When we have faith and we believe that he can give us what we need. And then because we believe that, we know that faith and deeds go together. Because we believe that. We surrender, and that's where the actions come in. And when we surrender, we are obeying. We obey him according to that surrender, according to that faith. And when we do that, we please God. And we become, we get more of the flow of the Spirit. Because when we're putting things down, when, when we stop pursuing what we want above what he knows we need, we aren't in his way. And so he moves through us by the Spirit much more smoothly. And I also learned about want versus need that sometimes he leads us to put down what we want because it's a faith test. It's a faith test to see if we believe that we can still be well and that we can still thrive, I guess, without the thing that we want. And a lot of the times what we want can be taking his place and that's why he wants us to put it down so that he can give us what we need so that we can fully understand that he is the one that we should rely on because he is the one that will forever satisfy our needs. Because he formed us in the womb. He knew us, you know, before the foundation of the world. And he knows us better than we know ourselves. So that is why. Why it's so important, especially now, especially as a bride, as the kingdom builders, as the the ones that do the heavy duties, we for sure must learn how to put down what we want. And by faith and by surrendering and obeying, we must learn how to put down what we want so that we can receive what we need because all throughout eternity we are going to be doing the heavy tasks, you know, and we're going to need to be prepared for those things. We're going to need to know how to exercise discipline. We're going to need to know how to do what must be done over what we want to have done.
because the bride will be put in leading position and you know what I mean how can you be a leader without having discipline you know and that's another reason why we fast because that's showing God that we have faith to know that if we put down what we want he'll give us what we need so I wanted to share that with you guys and for those of you that just popped in on this channel, welcome again. And I would invite you to check out my early videos on this channel because I go over the basics. I talk about faith in this channel and I want to be as clear as possible on this channel so that it can benefit you guys in your walks with him so that you can learn um, just how, how important faith is. And so, I invite you guys to check out my earlier videos because I talk about what faith is, what faith does, and how to apply it. And once we understand and know those things, then we can soar in the faith. So, that's what I wanted to share with you guys. God bless you and bye-bye.